Hi everyone, this is Irene. Uh, I've got an entry here from Kerry. I do apologise, um, I've had this dreaded headache all day. And I've been waiting till I feel better so I can open it, but I don't. And so I'll open it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Kerry. I'm, I'm not sounding too enthusiastic. But I, I was very excited when I got it, thank you, and still am. Wow, how exciting. Oh my lord. Thank you. That's why I got the radio on, so you saw now when the radio's on, I'm not feeling good. So it's the cameo with the bird is pop dotted on. What's pop dotted mean? Pop dotted on. Ah, oh, that's what I I do. I did those too. Oh, so is that called pop dotted on? got exactly the same cameos and <laughs> how cool is that yeah oh well maybe you can explain how they came around with pop dotted what that means is pop dotted on uh, in case you want to use it the cameo with a bird oh okay I think you mean it's detachable Ah, is that what you mean? Oh, okay. That is so clever. Aren't you a clever girl? Are they uh, those Prima ones, are they? Or That is really clever. I do like that. Thank you. And that's beautiful, um... What do you call it? Hemp. The Americans call it and we call it burlap. How cool is it? Thank you. There's some goodies in here. Well done. Butterfly, oh, very cool. That'll make a really cool stencil for art journaling. How cool is that? Oh, that's so cool. Look at those. That is really cool. I really would wish you would do videos. It'd be fantastic to, to see what you do. Well, we know what you do, but, you know, I'm... Um, oh, wow. You made that. How cute is that? Oh, okay. That's where you stick it on. And that's the front. How clever is that? That is so clever. Thank you. That's really pretty. That's, that's pretty. That's a, a little leaf. It's been stickled. That's a beautiful colour leaf. I wonder if that's the way it came or if you sprayed it. It's a really rich. Look sprayed. There's all different browns in that. Really 
it pretty. Oh, this is another one. Oh, it's pretty. Thank you. I hope you see seeing these properly. Um, it's better, hopefully. Gorgeous vintage looking bread pearl. Beautiful. Thank you, Carrie. And you've sewed that yourself on the machine. Violet. Oh, that is so pretty. Thank you. Says Irene, hope you like these two ATCs I've sent you. I've only ever done two before, but thought I'd have a try at them. I think they're going to be addictive. Have you seen ATBs on YouTube? Yes. So um, I think Silly Eels introduced us to them. Yes, I've. Uh, yeah, well, to me anyway. I'm in the process of trying one of them. Hugs, Carrie. How exciting! Wow, that'll be cool. Love to see that, Carrie. Okay. So these must be pretty ATCs, and look at this gorgeous paper. Wow. And this beautiful washi tape. Stunning. This would be one for Sonia. I think this was meant for Sonia, wasn't it? Just joking. Um, oops. I'm so sorry about my choker. Um, how am I going to fix this? Oh. oh, that is really pretty. Oh, look at that. Handmade for you by Carrie. Ah, oh. aren't you a sweetie? Thank you. That is beautiful paper. Oh, thank you. You are so sweet in your um. You've done all my challenges and you know I've. Uh, it's very sweet of you to include these for me. I really appreciate that. Look at that beautiful bird. Isn't that stunning? And the hearts. The little journey. And the stickles there and the beads along there. Again, I apologise if I'm vague with the description. I just thumping left side of my head's thumping away. Beautiful inked edges and, and of course the feather to go with the bird theme. That is really pretty. <gasps> I love this. Very Halloweenish, steampunkish. Not big on Halloween. Don't like what it represents. Oh no, that's Thanksgiving. Yep, 
I don't like what Thanksgiving represents. A lot of Indians died and they took their food and burnt them and, and that's how Thanksgiving came about. Don't mean to offend the Americans, but I've, I've got a half Native American friend that told me that, so. Um, because I do love America. I, ever since I was a little girl, I've always wanted to live in uh, California. Well, if I ever get rich, I will buy property in America, that's for sure. This is beautiful. Sorry, getting back on track. I love, love the orange and black and steampunk. I don't know if it's typical steampunk. I'd... I just assume it's Halloween steampunk. What I meant to say is, um, I don't, I'm not big on Halloween, like I don't make Halloween cars and all that. But but I love the orange and the black, the colours of it. Fall, as you call it, we call it, we call it autumn, but you call it fall. I think fall sounds so much better, and it's so literal, isn't it? Love the netting. That's like uh, Kerry's trademark. She she does a lot of this. And Kerry, if you recall, remember my last challenge? I'll quickly show this. She made me a box, and this is that. And I, I use it, and I put all... My, I've got a sign, and here I put my jewellery findings, spaces, chains, silver, gold bits and pieces and here you can see she uses her the the netting here yep. so, a lot of and um the last thing you sent me as well that lovely pin cushion thing um that's got netting too really nice that is beautiful thank you carrie gorgeous love that thank you Okay, this is very exciting. Look at this bag. That is gorgeous. Very cute. Thank you. Oh, these are the beautiful hearts Carrie put on them. Oh, I do have to get a heart die cut. They're just gorgeous. And look at that. Oh, how cute. I love that presentation. Isn't that just... Oh, oh sorry. I, I saw the swap you did, Kerry, with Belinda Kualacrafts. And uh, that was really cool. And I'm currently doing one with her too. So, yeah. Oh, my Lord. Thank you. Are they called elongated hearts? Uh, Dwellers, you've recently made some beautiful fabric elongated hearts. Sorry, I'm just putting... That's better. And these are cut on really pretty colour. It's a, oh, gorgeous. It's pearly, beautiful paper. Oh. Johnny, love that, Kerry. Thank you. Beautiful. Oh, that's pretty. Look at that. Thank you. I do apologise for not letting you know that it had arrived. I should have, um, yeah, I should have messaged you. But I know how it's like, you know, when you send something to someone, you know, you it's you want them to contact you and say that it's arrived. So I'm sorry for that. These are really pretty. Mm, thank you. Gorgeous and they're tied up. That's really pretty. Even though I like feathers, I I won't buy them off in, off the internet because I won't buy them full stop. I won't order them. If they're already in the shops, I will, but I won't actually order them 
off the internet in China because I think I wouldn't be surprised if they're gonna go kill a chook because of my order you know and yeah I, I know that sounds weird but anyway don't want any chickens dying for me because I want to make my projects look cute I wonder if anyone else is as goofy as me. We've got another card. You made me another one. Oh. Oh, thank you. Oh, how sweet. Oh, lovely. Love that. It looks like they're trimming my store, isn't it? Ah, thank you. Very nice. Hi, Irene. How are you? Yeah, a bit sick. <laughs> this is my entry for your challenge. Hope you like it. I went with a vintage sewing theme. I've attached a peg, so if you want to hang it up, you can. The large tag has dirt flowers on the bottom, and you can get caught on the lace pocket. Just be careful when you slide it out. This is uh, my first old tip-book page with lace pockets and tags. Oh, that sounds interesting. Wow. That is a really pretty card. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kerry. Wow. What a beautiful presentation. Look at this. I might hold it up because I'm not sure. This is bigger and I want you to see it all. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful bow. And you've tied that bow really perfect too. And I love the way you've cut the ends. Look at that exquisite fabric. Little table cloth or whatever you call them. That is really pretty. Oh wow. Oh thank you. I'm going to have to put this down because I can't. Hopefully you can... Um, okay. Oh, just let, let, let me look at this, take this in and then I'll uh, put the camera on it. It's um, pre it's uh, it's pretty much on it now, I think. Oh wow! You've put so much work into this. This is so beautiful. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? That is exquisite. And Kerry said this is um, it's a large tag, has dotted flowers on the bottom. Oh, okay. You mean these? Fat back. I would have called them fat back purse. Um, you can't get caught on the lace pocket. Just be careful when you slide it out. Oh, you're talking about the tag. Okay. Right. I'm with you. I will be careful. Wow. Look at that. Oh. 
is the same. Wow. So I'm going to quickly take it in and then I'll show you. So I'm sorry. This is so cool. There's so many little bits and things. It's really exciting. And this is so cool. Oh my lord. Oh, and the peg. Oh, I love it. Look at the peg. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my lord. It's really pretty. Oh, I love that technique there. It's so pretty. Thank you, Carrie. There's so much going on here. It's very, very happening. Whoopsie daisy. Oh. That's beautiful. Look at that pocket. And there's another pocket there. There's so much happening. And there's another tag too. Oh my lord. You're a clever girl. Look at all this. Wow. So I'll put that back in. There. And then this one. Went. That is so cool. Oh, Carrie. Thank you. How stunning is that? Right. I've figured it out. And that's what I love about what you make. Everything is like, it's like a little puzzle. <laughs> All right. Now, so this is Carrie's beautiful tag. And the bottom's got bottom's got quite a few layers of lace. Got beautiful trim. There's that layer in that layer. And then I'll just show you this side and then when I turn it over. Anyway, um, look, there's just heaps. Isn't that it's so beautiful? And that looks like uh, an image from Graphic 45. And stickles there. And beautiful applique silver. That's a little metal, metal corner and I love how you've done that. That looks uh, antique -ish and old. Love that technique. That's like uh, a blue and a uh, bit of the tea stone perhaps. Gorgeous bling. Look at that. Been stick with maybe. And then uh, one of your gorgeous crocheted flowers. Beautiful lace pocket that looks like it's been done with a lovely curtain type fabric measure tape. It's a fabric measure tape. And across here it's finished off with this gorgeous, it looks like the edge of a really soft crochet diary. It's beautiful. And these lovely uh, purpley mauve buttons which goes so beautiful with, with this beautiful tag that comes out here and this image is from um, Needle and Craft it's uh, probably one of the collectibles or from the back here yeah. and that's been tea stained 
Uh, not tea stained, inked with the tea stain distress ink. Oh, look at that spring collection. And this beautiful paper there. And there's another kind of vellum like paper under that that's peeking out. If you can see that there. And this beautiful little crochet dolly that you've dyed, I'd say. The lovely mauve colour. Look at that beautiful June. Love how you finished that off. Beautiful button. Vintage looking. Beautiful shell. Uh, pearl. Pearly shell buttons. Gorgeous. Lace. And flower. Even the flower's been lightly inked with mauve. Your attention to detail is amazing. Handmade for you. Isn't that beautiful? And now that that tags out, you can see a little bit better what's going on in this elaborate tag. So there's some more curtain fabric here, which houses another tag there. But before we take that out, we'll just look at these beautiful ribbons. Isn't that stunning? What a dainty little ribbon. I mean lace trim, sorry. And look at that. Oh my god, I've just seen it. How cute. Keeping up with the sewing theme that's throughout this whole tag. Um, oh, never seen these before. These are absolutely stunning. Do they really open? No. <laughs> But they're so cute. Looks like they can be used. And that is a little thing to. Oh, that is so cute. To stop your thing from getting pricked in your fingers. A little safety pin tied up with the little silver elastic trim. And over here, got beautiful lace, lace trim. Goes all the way up. This beautiful flower, inked with a little mauve. And now we're gonna take out the next tag here. Aha! Uh -huh. These are the little flower doodles you're talking about. These are from my store. Oh, fantastic. Look at that. Aren't they beautiful? I was actually thinking of um, having a, a DT call for my shop. It would be really interesting, but I'm going to ask that the people that are going to enter would have to use my products or similar products. Someone's done that. Someone did that. I think it was, was it Lily? She asked people to use similar things too. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that makes sense, doesn't it? Nothing wrong with that. This is beautiful. Look at all the detail. Yes, these are the those cards. I've got a few of them and I still haven't used them. They've been hoarded. And um, so that's the base. Handmade for you by Kirsty. And then on top of that you've put like dictionary paper. And then on top of that is a lovely vellum with little raised spots. Can you see that? Then we've got a beautiful sewing machine. And we've got this gorgeous doily. Oh, that is so cute. I love that. Love how you've done that. 
How cute is that? Oh, look at that stain. That is beautiful. 60 cents a strap. What a beautiful stamp. And I love how it's been used. You can see the black there. The stamp. I love that. A beautiful button, a bit of a doily in the metal flowers. And it's got a beautiful little uh, little trim. Looks like it's been cut from the same material as the pockets here. It's really pretty. Thank you so much. Oh look, got a beautiful little button here. Bit of trimmed twine. And also there's this beautiful, beautiful um, mauve ribbon too. Oh, that is gorgeous. Love that mauve thing. Beautiful. And then when you've done that, it reveals this beautiful peg. That's got uh, gorgeous measuring tape on it. These two flowers with a bit of mauve. That cute. It's got a little, little hanger too. That's so cute. Love that. And uh, that's got like dictionary paper stuck onto that. And then we turn that around. And over here we've got that beautiful lace. Love how you've done done that. The bow with the June and the flower and all those lovely pretty laces. It's really pretty. And crochet. This beautiful white lace. We've got this pocket. Oh, that is really pretty lace. Look at that. And look at this tag. Before I show you the tag, this is the background. And that is so beautiful. That looks like it's... Um, is that supposed to come off? No, it's not. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, love that. Uh, is that the cover or, the, or that, that pattern? That is so cool. I'm trying to figure out if it's the little box it came, the packet it came in on. And uh, it's been sewn there. And then this netting has been put on top of it. Softens it up and blends it all in with each other. That looks really pretty. It's been sewn along here. And a little bit of green along there. Your attention to detail is amazing. Wow. And this is a beautiful tag. Yes, I remember these are really pretty. Look at that. Again, um, where did that come from? That's beautiful. I wonder which collection that is. That's a really pretty collection. So you've sewn that with the shades of what's in there. How clever is that? That shade matches with that. That shade matches with that. And it's been lightly stickled. And then this one here. Oh, look, it's got zips. How cool is it? So that side's got a zip. And then this side's here got a zip. And over here, we can see the zip. Ah, okay, see? We've got the zip there. And the way she's 
design that it looks like, you know, it's, does it? <laughs> that is so cool. Love that. And this is uh, beautiful mauve. Love that. Gorgeous. And lovely dictionary paper that's, oh my lord, look at that detail. It's got some beautiful vellum embossed paper. Can you see that? This is magnificent, Carrie. Wow. This beautiful velvet green trim. And a gorgeous little, oh, look at that. Isn't that stunning? Oh, it's so pretty. And that beautiful mauve crochet there. And this beautiful colour paper, I love that. Lightly inked pearl trim. Oh, that is exquisite. And look at the back. Handmade for you by Kiz T. And little button too. How cool is that? Thank you so much, Carrie. What a beautiful, beautiful tag. I love this. This is beautiful. So that's Carrie's beautiful entry to my challenge. Isn't that stunning? Lots of work. And if I can remember, is it that one? No. Mm -hmm. I think it was this one. Don't... Sorry, guys. Hold on. Hi, Maddie. What are you doing? You alright? Sorry guys, now we're going to... Probably got these all in wrong. But I'm um, okay. Sorry. So kiss tea. Now oh, this is beautiful. Definitely hanging this up. Isn't that stunning? I'm sorry I didn't put it in properly. But that, that looks good like that too. <laughs> That is absolutely stunning. Um, I'm thinking this is entry number eight to my challenge. And again, my challenge has been extended until the 15th of November. Please watch the original video because I've tweaked it and added annotations. So it's got the details in that. Or you can just read the description. But basically all you need to know that it's the 15th of November final postings and I'm going to give it two weeks which is the 29th of November for the, everything to arrive and then on the 30th I'll announce the seven winners so there's seven winners and I, I will put the link below in, in this to that and to Kirsty, even though she doesn't do videos, go, go along and sub to her and talk to her. She's a lovely lady and she she might put videos up soon. So thank you, my dear friend. And I'm so sorry, I should have done two parts to this. It's going to take forever to upload. This is absolutely very beautiful and I love it. It's so thoughtful. Thank you so much for for all that carrying the beautiful ATCs you made me absolutely stunning and this bag of goodies you've really spoilt me you're a real sweetheart love your work and please please videotape it don't be shy thanks all bye thank you Carrie